you couldn't tell, this is actually my um, quarantine concert outfit. Anyways, today's video is going to be about Haley's experience. This is my second year in the program, and I'm honestly just so sad that we didn't get to perform our concert. I was really looking forward to it out of the four selections of music that I've seen. This was definitely my favorite. The reason for that was because like I had so many of the songs already that like I knew the words to, so it was just really interesting to see how the music was all laid out. I are for two years now, and the scariest part was auditioning because my entire life I've been mostly a part of just um, bands and music ensembles. I've always seen choir like on the side and I never involved, but I got tired of being in the symphonic band here, so I decided that I would try to join the choir. I was scared because I've never really sang in front of anyone before, but it was fine. It's just so welcoming. My favorite, my favorite part is that it's the best part of the day because you get to spend so much time being loud and talking instead of writing notes and paying attention. You get to, you get to share your energy and you get to accept everybody else's energy. And you, you actually get to talk to the people beside you and you get to hear them and you get to know them. I think that's really cool because a lot of classes are like that. It's so a shame right now that this is one of the classes that's been taken away because I think this is one of the things that would help with like mental health the most. Singing is good for your lungs, it's good for your body, it's good to feel the energy of the other people, it's good to socialize for your health. And it's a shame that this isn't one of the activities that we can do to be together right now because that's one of the things that would help us. Choir gets me really emotional. It's it's one of the strange things that does that to me. It like sometimes even even when we're in class, especially a performance, but even when we're in class and we're just like all singing and it just sounds so good, like it just makes me want to tear up, even even when we say it's a happy song and it's, we're over the rainbow and we're supposed to be smiling and happy, I just, I'm just so, so, I just want to cry because it's just how I feel. I just really appreciate that there's something that can make me feel it. I really did enjoy singing Skyfall because that's a song that I already knew all the words to, too, and, you know, I just got, like, excited and I saw the video and, and I was exposed to new ways, or not new ways, but new performances of the song. Um, one thing that choir does is if I get a song that I've never seen before or even one that I have seen before, when I go look up other songs to listen to so I can hear different versions of it and different parts, I always find a new version of it that's super cool and I love to listen to it and I, I have a special playlist that I add all of those songs to so that I can remember them but I found even like instrumental versions or the choral versions I've listened to some groups and then I've gone on YouTube for hours and listened to the, uh, the entire group's songs until I ran out. One of my other favorite songs was the Hanging Tree from The Hunger Games. I love singing just as the group of girls. You just feel more the like, harmony of your own sound and the movie Good Book that I loved growing up. And I wanted to audition for the solo for this because I thought it would be a good part for someone who can't actually sing but is trying hard to make the part just like what it suggests in the thing. But um, I just struggle with performing to that, and so I didn't feel like doing that, but um, just what, what a good song, and I was, and I'm just so sad we didn't get to perform because I loved hearing when I couldn't do it myself and I heard, I don't even know who got it, but we did it, we only got to do it once, but it, um, I really enjoyed it, so, yeah. 
who I love, The Greatest Showman. I accidentally, um, I saw it by accident because I went to the movie theater to see a different movie and it was sold out, so we had to pick a different movie and so we picked The Greatest Showman. I didn't really know what it was, but we went to see it and afterwards I loved it. I listened to the soundtrack in the car afterwards and we were singing along with um, all the words, but it's interesting because like this song is um, one of the ones that I didn't love the most. I probably liked a few other songs better than this one, but um, I think my mind really changed when I was exposed to the video in class of the group, um, well, of her originally performing it. Um, after having that message and just everyone in the room and all of their energy and I actually like cried a little bit watching it so I I feel like I enjoy this song more now and it's gone higher up my scale of my favorite songs from that movie. Oh Fortuna. After all after we watched the video on this one of all of the different sayings, I can't unhear it and I've now recently come to hear how popular this song is. I knew, I've heard it before many times, but now just, I don't know if it's like coincidence or not, but I've heard it about four times in TV movies. Just, I've been watching a lot because, you know, there's been nothing else to do. And, and it's come up a lot, and I, every time I'm like, ah, and I think back to that video, it's crazy. Mission Impossible was not what I expected it to be. It was crazy. I didn't think we could do it at first, but we ended up being able to do it. Um, just like a childhood favorite song, and the way it was arranged was super sweet, and I'm just, it was so good. <laughs> I tried to give this class my 100%, but Sometimes I just think everybody's individual level of 100% is different from each other's because sometimes I try so hard and I just, I hear other people sing and I'm just like, how, how do you, how do you get that good? I don't know, one thing that I would like to know more about since I don't really know too much about singing is just, I always try to pay attention to like how when you, when you specifically say my mouth should be more open or my tongue should be back, I try to, I really try to apply it so. The only thing I could wish for is just like more of that, more trying to understand singing as someone who may not 100% know. One of the movies that I would add to our concert would have have to have been something from like High School Musical or Camp Rock. I just love those so much growing up and I already know all the words. I wanted to do something with Asia for the video because she's just like such a star. But um, we ended up not <laughs> wanting to do it, but um, it would have been super funny. But I think that would have been good. But yeah, I don't know if it would have been perfect for the uh, choir setting because there's not really a need for all of the people, but it would have been really good as one of the solo individual acts. Bye! Thank you for watching my video about my choir experience. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so, so much for um, teaching us this year. I'm so sad we didn't get to perform. I was really looking forward to it, and I hope we all get to sing together again soon. Bye.